this is an amazing magazine. One of the things that we did when we went through our communication audit for the Diocese of Texas was really figure out how we could share the stories uh, that are happening in this diocese. There's so many amazing things happening and we have barely touched on them. But we decided one way that we would begin to do that is through an annual type magazine that we kind of lay before you some high points that we accomplished uh, in the diocese together. And so we did that. I mean, we had the election of Bishop Bryan and her ordination and consecration. We had the continued work of Harvey, which really took on some new life in 2019, uh, as well as all of the mission uh, work that we did, both in service as congregations reached out into their community, but also in evangelism, evangelism efforts like missional communities and church plants and everything like that. You know, this is a, a good report. This gives you a sense of some of the great stories. And one of the things I was really struck by as Tammy and her her team took on the work this year for the first time, uh, Tammy doing that work uh, with Ellie and Paulette and uh, with LaShane, was these stories are really from your perspective. And so they're stories about the people of the diocese. Uh, and I think that that takes on, that just made me so happy to read about the work that you were doing. When I'm in your congregations, a lot of times the blessing that I use talks about praying to God for power, mercy, love, those things that are needed and gifts and talents to do the ministry that we're given because that's the way in which we see we become miracles and the, the, the hand at work uh, on God's behalf in the world. And I think that this magazine is a great uh, view of what you all have been doing in the diocese. And I encourage you to pick it up in part because I want you to see what I get to see and what your diocesan staff gets to see as they travel around the diocese and looks at the work that you do. But I hope you'll look at it. And as we get ready for council and our kind of common life in the year 2020 together, I hope you'll look at it and see who you can encourage to continue the amazing ministry that they're doing on God's behalf. So for the work that you have done and for good friends uh, to do it with, I'm thankful.